It is Sophia the Shadow Hunter, and today I'm going to be doing a reaction video to my favorite headache. I just got home from work last night, about late last night, and I got it in the mail surprisingly, and so I listened to it um, today when I got up, and I love this album. This album came out on record day last year and I did not get it um, but I got it this year and I'm just so excited to have it to add to my record collection and to talk about it with you. Um, I think there's lots of things to be said about this album number one. This album probably would have not happened if Rush didn't if Rush had not had their five year hiatus after the passing of Neil's wife and daughter. Um, so this album is I think it's about 19 years old. It came out I believe in 2000 and 2000, 2001. So right before right before Vapor Trails came out, and it is a phenomenal album. Um, I love the songs on it, and it's just a great album, so let's listen to the album, and we can talk about it. So here it is, My Favorite Headache. I'm only going to be doing Side A today. I originally was going to try to do a live stream for this, but the live stream doesn't want to work because the internet has been slow lately, and so to spare minutes with me, we're going to do Side A. So here's Side A off of Getty's album, My Favorite Headache.
back my favorite headache off of Getty's album, My Favorite Headache. Yes, this, this is the present tense. I love this song. to the world.
guys, we got Working Out Perfect. This is gonna be my first favorite song. Excuse me, this is my first hit from this album. Um, I probably first heard this album. I think in the fall of 2007 or the fall of 2008. I think it was the fall of 2007. recognize that part as I have it if I have it's been a while so let me know guys in the comments down below what you prefer listening to do you prefer records
tapes, digital audio, CDs, vinyl. I recently got into vinyl and also recently got into tapes. Now I love tapes. I recently bought a really cute cassette tape which, um, player, which I'll show you guys in a video soon. And we'll do a listen to of those as well. Last year I found out that record sales were going to be going up, which I think is true because Walmart started selling records, as you guys know. I've sold you a lot of those records. I also have more record haul. I need to film for you guys as well. So let me know down in the comments down below what you prefer to listen to your music on. Do you like headphones, not headphones? I've been a headphone geek for since I really got into music, but I go through headphones so fast. And so I also am going to start doing some videos talking about headphones. But I just love the sound of vinyl. I like that it's old timey. I like that there's it is an action. You have to go and go put it on, or like a CD. I also love CDs. Um, but I just I love vinyl. You get to hear it pop. I just I think it makes you more in tune. The idea of back in the old days, which is the other thing I love about you go to the record store, you buy the record, you put it on, and you go through it. And that's kind of like what my dad and I would do with Rush CDs and music. And I still do that today. Just um, I do it by myself now instead of um, with my dad because he's busy and we're all busy and I have to do this when it fits my schedule. But I just I love that idea of doing that. I I like having the artwork that it comes with it. Um, just it's it's fun. It's something you can collect. It can be some also or tied piece. I hope you guys like this video. If you haven't, go subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys in another video. Goodbye.